Ty Quinones and right now in your 13 Action News update, COVID-19 test positivity is up once again. But nearly 22% of all COVID tests taken in the last two weeks now have come back positive. Well, that blue line right there really should be much closer to the green line. Also, 40 more deaths now have been reported as well. But as you can see, the 14 day average of deaths is trending down. Governor Steve Sisolak in the meantime is expected to give an update on the restrictions one week from tonight. Well, money from the first COVID-19 stimulus package has helped several local families pay off electricity bills. North Las Vegas leaders say that they partnered with Envy Energy to pay bills for some 4,200 households. Many families had fallen behind on payments because of the pandemic, and Envy Energy also waived late fees and penalties as well. The city is currently accepting online applications to help homeowners and renters, as well as small business owners. Well, it appears that Henderson is getting a brand new resort casino. Marnell Gaming, which owns the Nugget in Sparks, is planning to buy some land by the 15 in St. Rose Parkway. That is right near the M Resort. According to documents found with the city, the resort would bring at least 100 new jobs to the city. A mostly cloudy sky and mild conditions expected for Wednesday. Wake up temperatures in the mid 40s. We do expect increasing cloud cover into your Wednesday afternoon with highs back in the mid 60s, almost 10 degrees above the seasonal average. The partly to mostly cloudy skies sticking around for the majority of your Wednesday with a touch more sunshine expected moving into Thursday. By Friday, gustier wind returns to the region that knocks temperatures back down to seasonal averages in the mid to upper 50s starting Friday through the weekend. Danny, thank you. That was your 13 Action News update. Remember, you can always get the latest news at KTNV.com.